Well, Caleb, you got got the ball rolling with that fumble return for a touchdown. Just how big was that play, to, after, especially when the offense didn't get going on that first possession, just getting that first score and kind of setting the tone for the rest of the game? Yeah, I think it definitely set the tone. Um, I mean, that's something that we've been talking about for a couple of weeks, uh, well, actually a few weeks just trying to score it on defense because, I mean, it's been a while, um, probably since the beginning of the season that we came out and got a score. So, I mean, that was pretty big time, especially for the – at least it, it turned up the defense for sure. I mean, we were like, hey, now let's go out here and do it again, you know, so. Yes, sir. Uh, you know, you're coming off this big loss against Arkansas State, 77 to 31. Just what was the mentality of, like leading up to this game? Just trying to get back, get everything back on track. You know, seeing the seniors out on a good note and just kind of getting getting that seventh win. Oh yeah, I mean the message this week was like, don't forget who you are. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we know who we are. Like we know what we can do. So the question was just like, are we going to show the world? Are we going to do this? So it was a great opportunity considering that we were on NFL Network and I mean, senior night and at home. So it was it was pretty fun and it was it was, it was that's big to come out here and do, and do that after a 77, 31 loss. I mean, it's big time. Um, a lot of these guys been here for three, four years, and they haven't seen more than four games, uh, more four, four game winning season. You know, so it's big time. I know the alums. Uh, it's been a while since they've seen a winning season. So I mean, to, for us to do this for them, it, I mean, that, it really turns us up and gives them some momentum going into the bowl game. I know the defense had a very rough outing against Arkansas State. Just what was kind of y'all's mentality heading into this uh, South Alabama game, especially when it, with a tough uh, offense like them? Oh, yeah. I mean, like I said, don't forget who we are. Stop the run and, you know, uh, stop the pass. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I mean, we, we uh, like I said uh, last interview, I always trust uh, Coach Packey's um, defense, his, his uh, you know, all of it. So, I mean, as far as, as far as coming into this game, like I said, we couldn't forget who we are and we were just going to go out there and show the world. You know, this team finishes with a 5-1 and one home record. Just what is it about playing at Bobcats Stadium that makes y'all such a tough out at home? Oh, I mean, you know you know what they say, pack the whack. So, I mean, it went, it, it's big time when it, when we see a bunch of people. And, to, I mean, it's it's Thanksgiving break, you know what I'm saying? So, for them to fill the, fill the whack up like that, I mean, that's big time. We needed all of that. And, um, I mean, hopefully we, we keep it going. You know, clinching that seventh win, first winning season since 2014, what does it mean to be able to do this, especially in y'all's first year? I mean, I'm not gonna lie. We this is, before the season started, we knew we could go to a bowl game. We knew we had the talent. You know what I'm saying? So I mean, for us, it's it's big time now. You know what I'm saying? But we we definitely knew what we were capable capable of. And um, I mean, we just like I said, we always just want to show the world that we can do that. Do you have a preference on which bowl game you want to go to? Man, uh, I, I would like to go to NOLA, but uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah.